Yeah, thank you so much for uh, having me here. I think you have a full packed, exciting agenda for today. Uh, and sound, sorry. If you need. Thank you. Uh, thank you for having me here. Uh, I think you have a very full packed agenda for today. It looks very exciting. <clears throat> I'm just going to open with a small, small flavor of what we're doing at, uh, at uh, Vattenfall. And we are on an exciting journey of, of change towards a more towards fossil freedom and towards more climate smarter customer experiences, because that's what our customer uh, wants. And uh, let me also say, I think it's very uh, exciting times to be in energy. Uh, it is, as you know, a very exciting industry. It brings lives, it's uh, critical for society, and it contains so much data, so we know how people, how people live, and it really touches people's lives in so many uh, different ways. And it's never been uh, more important to be in energy, also given the climate change, and the uh, also exciting transformation going on in this industry. And given the climate change, the in, uh, energy industry really needs to step up and have, uh, we really have uh, solutions for, 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 for that, if we cooperate. So very exciting, exciting times and change going around all over the place. You know that change is accelerating all over, not just within climate, uh, but also within society how we live, work, travel, etc. And also the customers are becoming more and more empowered, informed, uh, and, and with new, uh, and rightly so, new demands on, on us. And new disruptive players are entering the, <coughs> the scene and, 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 and the industry in our margins and, uh, and positions no longer secure. And knowledge today is becoming a commodity. So how do we reinvent and constantly invent new knowledge? To, to, keep, uh, to keep ahead. And that's what we are trying to think about and how to do that. And we think uh, one key is, of course, to stay very, very close to uh, the customers and understand their, their needs and, and build great experiences around our uh, services. Uh, but also to act on this change, adapt to it, and act uh, with speed and flexibility. And, uh, and of course, digitalization automation is one part of it. But it's really an exciting transformation journey, uh, and we think some key words is innovation, every day, ongoing, as the normal part of our, our work, uh, to invent new, new knowledge and solutions. And in able to do that, we need a lot more uh, cooperation, because we cannot do everything uh, ourselves. And uh, also, to be able to do that, and to cope with this changing environment, we need to be in an engaging place. I mean, we need to let our employees come here with their passion and creativity to help us create all these new uh, innovation and solutions uh, for, for customer society and to make sure that we deliver on um, the gated experiences for customers as, as well. And it all starts with our purpose. Why do we do this? Uh, for us, it's about uh, powering climate smarter living and making sure we all can live a fossil-free, fuel-free life within one generation. And in order to do that, we need to act on scale to th through the whole chain. And as a big, uh, big company, you can do that, but you also need to cope with other big companies and small companies to, uh, to be able to achieve this. And uh, these experiences that we want to create and how we want to be perceived we want to be a very open and transparent company with an open source thinking wherever that is, that is possible. Uh, very active, not reactive. Here we need to step ahead and, uh, and, and be very active and proactive in creating the new solutions for, for society and the customers and have a positive approach because there are good solutions for the climate issue and also for, for great experiences whether it's at companies or at home for customers. And then, of course, our operations is all about safety, whether it's the operations, but also keeping the customer data safe. So these are important principles for us to live with. And it's not, so it's not only you know, digitalization, technology, etc. It's about the cultural change of trying to live like that. And when we create and when we work, there are three strategic areas that we are highly focusing on. Our purpose is, of course, embedded in everything uh, we, we, uh, we do. 
but especially within three uh, growth areas. Renewable energy, where we invest a lot and intend to continue doing so. Electrification of everything that can be electrified with clean energy, like transports uh, and industries. You can hear some examples soon. And also uh, great decentralized solutions for, for house and, and, pro and properties. As I said, we cannot do this by ourselves, and we try to work as much as we can together with, uh, uh, com uh, with uh, customers and, uh, and partners. And we are powering up some pretty cool customers that we're really proud of, whether they are you know, large server halls up north that needs a lot of renewable, stable, clean energy, uh, or, uh, or uh, like SSAB uh, or Volvo, where we had a long-term cooperation, and also a lot of food companies that really have a strong sustainability agenda and expect us to help them drive that. So that is a part of our, uh, our role, to help them become more, more sustainable. And also, as I said before, new demand arises all the time from our uh, private customers, keeping us uh, uh, on, on the toe. We do a lot of trying to uh, achieve our purpose, and the journey has, but the journey has just started. Some few products that you are going to hear more about today is hybrids, where we're trying to uh, achieve fossil-free steel together with SSAB and LKB, but that would re revolutionize the uh, steel industry and take down carbon uh, emissions uh, a lot in-house which is about uh, decentralized, integrated, customized solutions for large uh, real estate and properties. And then in charge, our um, uh, charging network with over 5,000 uh, stations around now in, in, in Europe to enable uh, electrification of cars. So some large, long-term uh, projects that we feel is moving in the right direction for our purpose but also some other small projects, smaller projects, however yet as important, like for instance the energy hackathon uh, we did last year, together with uh, Framtidens Energi, or, or rather the uh, Facebook group Framtidens Energi was formed after this event. And it was like we saw an interest from our customers that they, want, they, they wanted to know and had an interest about what are the solutions for energy in the future, what can it be, and what can energy be in the future. So we said let's hack it together with entrepreneurs, uh, customers, students, uh, and Vattenfall employee. We did a hackathon. There was a lot of interest around it, and after that, uh, the, uh, everybody could not participate. Hence, the Facebook group Framtids Energy was, was uh, formed. And I'm so happy that Amira and all of you engaged in that group is taking it now further uh, and uh, continue the engaging dialogue regarding uh, what energy, sustainable energy can be in the future. So well done everybody taking part of, of that. And really cooperation and, and um, innovation is really part of our DNA. When you look ahead, sometimes it's good also to, to look back, where do we come from? And Vattenfall is the company that once electrified Sweden, and around that a lot of solutions and innovation uh, arose, both within the energy industry but also outside. For instance, uh, Vattenfall invented the safety belt once, because we wanted our employees to be safe when they drove around the country uh, installing uh, things. That was later given, given to Volvo. And uh, I don't know if you guys know about the ARPANET, but that was a predecessor to internet. And Vattenfall and AVB had a cooperation of improving the ARPANET in the US to make it more stable, since we had a lot of knowledge within distribution of, of energy. Uh, so some pretty cool things uh, that we have in our past, but we want to be even uh, prouder of our future. And that's what we're now uh, looking uh, into and uh, looking forward to. Our world urgently needs to change and find alternative ways for cleaner powering and heating. Change has to happen and fast. At Vattenfall, we believe the solution is energy that is free from fossil fuels. We need to change how we live, how we work, how we produce, 
How we build. How we travel. At Vattenfall, we're determined to power and lead this change. We exist to help all our customers live their lives in ever climate smarter ways and enjoy fossil fuel free lives within one generation. As one of Europe's leading energy companies, our ambition is to become fossil free ourselves. But that's not enough. We also actively seek new partnerships inside and outside the energy industry, searching for new ways to achieve fossil freedom. For instance, we collaborate with the steel industry to develop a method for producing fossil-free steel that emits water instead of carbon dioxide. We help our customers to adopt smart technologies to create their own electricity or heat in an easy and affordable way. We are building a network of charging stations in Northern Europe together with our partners to accelerate the transition to electric cars. Our journey to fossil freedom is actively underway. Uh, of course, we want uh, as many as possible to join us to, uh, in our, our journey to, towards fossil freedom. Thank you.